Hi, Dana Crawford here. I'm on the road to Daytona Beach to an email, um, to a constant contact meeting, and I just thought of something to um, share with you because I've gotten a lot of questions about it, so what a great time to answer some questions while I'm driving. I have about um, 20 more minutes to go, so. All right, um, the question I thought I'd answer is people ask me, how much money can you make on eBay? And my answer for that is you can make whatever amount of money that you wanna make on eBay. So the sky's the limit. If you want to just use eBay to supplement your income, you can do that. If you want to use it to um, build a savings account, you can do that or, or to, for a trip or whatever. My point is that whatever amount or whatever your needs are, they can be met by being an eBay seller. And I am proof of this. I've been an eBay seller for 17 years and I've had my ups and my downs, but I've always been able to meet my goals. And that's the bottom line. It's all about goal setting. So I work a lot with um, stay-at-home moms, and that's how PowerSellingMom.com came into play. And that's my website. And so, because I wanted to teach moms how to learn to sell on eBay and stay at home and budget, create a business plan, and Meet, meet their needs by being an eBay seller because that's what I did. My kids, are, I have three kids, they're all grown and gone now and and um, my goal at that point was to prepare them for life and now I prepared them for life and, and now they're doing very well for themselves and that's what we do as parents to prepare our children for life. So I teach moms how to um, set goals. Now you don't have to be a mom to set a goal. Of course. All people. So what I do, and I've always done since the beginning, is I knew how much money I needed to make every month. So I would take my mortgage. At the time, I was a single mom, and it it was scary quitting all three of my jobs and going for eBay. But when I when I um, discovered the potential, I knew if I focused strictly on eBay, I could pull it off, and I did. And the way that I did it was I would, um, every month, at the, I would get a calendar. I used to sell Power Slave Mom calendar. I'll have to bring them back out. But what I used to do, or I still do today, is I set goals every month. And I started off with by putting the amount of money that I need to make at the top of the calendar. So you add your mortgage, your electric, um, your bills with the grand total that's how much you need to make to get by to make a living on eBay and then figure in your food and your expenses if you're going for it full time that's what you need to do if you're going for it part time still you still need to have some kind of a plan if you want to stay focused and meet that goal if you want to plan a trip to Hawaii or a trip to um, England or to Ireland where I'm going when you plan that trip um, you set a goal for how much money you need to make to take on that trip. And then what I did was I created a savings account just for my um, my trips and the things that, you know, my Louis Vuitton, my special things that I, I want just for me that are all about me, me. And I created that savings account because when on your PayPal account, you can trans you can have several bank accounts associated with your PayPal account and you can transfer money to your checking account, transfer money to your savings account, transfer money to the account your husband don't know about account. <laughs> Anyhow, you can transfer money to God, this guy is going so slow. You can transfer money to all, you know, different savings accounts and different bank accounts that you have set up for different reasons on eBay. So the goal, oh, there's a, a bear in the woods. Speed limit's 50. I just hope I, I'm actually about 55. Oh, that's all I need is a speeding ticket. Stay in the woods, Mr. Bear. 
Okay, now I forgot what I was talking about. <laughs> Setting goals. Big goal. Don't get a speeding ticket. <clears throat> but, um, no, seriously, you set your goals. And then, as you, you have your master amount of money you need at the top of your, your um, calendar. And then every day that you're making money on eBay, you write it down on that calendar. So you're getting closer at the total for the week, getting closer to that goal at the end of the week, and so on. And then by mid-month, you say, okay, I'm, I'm either close enough to my goal or I met my goal or whatever the situation is. But it makes life so much easier when you have goals. And if you're not meeting that goal, guess what? you got to go out and get some more stuff. So you need to get out and hustle and get some more items to get listed on eBay. And sometimes that's the case. So, you know, you got to got to check all your sourcing strategies for getting um, the items in there that are sure things. It's not about listing um, tons of quantity of items. I get consulting calls all the time. Oh, eBay sucks. I can't make any money. And they've got thousands of listings on eBay. Well, guess what? They've got thousands of listings of stuff. Okay, sorry. They got stuff that nobody wants. And the bottom line is they haven't researched their items so set your goal and it'll help you stay focused for um, making a living on eBay part-time full-time whatever whatever direction you go it works all right thank you this tip is uh, on the road with or Dana on the rough I'm Dana Crawford I'm almost to the Olive Garden in Daytona Beach thanks for joining me and until next time